The Democrats are trying to impeach the president that's given us probably the best economy in almost half a century, certainly the best job market and job numbers uh, in over half a century. More hi higher wages, more jobs, uh, a, lot, a lot better approach to our, our, our economic and national security. I, I think this is a sure loser for Democrats. Now, I'll tell you this. Yesterday was the day, if they actually go forward with the impeachment articles, that Nancy Pelosi solidified the fact that she will not be Speaker of the House next year because the Democrats will absolutely wow. lose wow. their majority in the House wow. of Representatives. Wow. Why, 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 do you, why do you say that? That's a pretty big, that's a pretty big because, statement. Be, be, because, Steve, you and Jason, as very seasoned political strategists, know when you're a politician who focuses on what you care about more than what the people who elect you care about, you lose. So, Tony, final question for you. One big thing here. Uh, what is the mood inside the White House as we close out this week? We're extremely bullish. We've been upbeat all along. We know the president's done nothing wrong, and we know that you know whatever happens in this impeachment mess, the president will come out on top and win re-election in 2020.